All right, all right, all right. Yeah, so welcome, welcome right here from the Hyperite home studio. <laughs> so I'm super excited today. I'm really excited. We have some really, really yeah, huge announcement. Uh, big new update and um, I really can't wait to, uh, to tell you. So um, let's start. Uh, first of all, welcome. Welcome all. Thanks for joining in. Happy to see you all there. Um, let's start with the announcement. Okay. So what we did. So we know that most of you guys use hybrid when you stream horror games, right? It makes most sense to stream your heart rate when you're basically, you know, playing something where you scream, where you really get shocked, where your heart rate, you know, bumps up and uh, also gets the best clips, right? So we were thinking, um, especially with all of the indie games that are up there, especially in the horror space, that we wanted to do something special, especially for this, for our horror game community, for our horror gamers um, who want to find new games, who want to join other communities and basically, you know, find and connect streamers like we do on our Discord, right? Also, one thing, if you want to ask any questions, we will do a Q&A right afterwards. You just need to put um, exclamation mark ask into the chat and it will be all sorted and I have all the questions this time then up to be sorted, right? Okay. A feature for horror gamers for horror games on all the communities within. So what we did there is um, basically uh, let me see, a new platform called Fright Rate. Some of you have been testing this um, in the past few weeks or um, some even for a longer time. And I want to uh, show it all to us, to, uh, to all of you, what we did there. So... What I'm going to show you now is some of this um, is still in beta state. Some of the features you haven't seen yet uh, since last year. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it's, it's oh, testing always needs some time, right? So I'm going to show you now what we did there. And I have to switch. Give me a second. First of all, your what you're seeing here is the heart rate of the whole team, <laughs> right? So the red heart is mine. The other three hearts are from our team that are, you know, here in the background joining. They will join us for the Q and A afterwards. You will you you can basically then listen to them and ask them questions. You see that some of us are really excited. We're all excited. Pulse is all above hundred, <laughs> right? So what you see there is fright rate. Um, basically the perf performance of this website for you is a whole lot better. <laughs> it's just my laptop that is very old, uh, where I'm showing you all of this right now. So excuse some hicks, uh, hiccups that are still happening on this side. So what you see on the main side is, um, basically all the horror games that have been played on stream, um, when you were using hype rates. So basically, if you are playing a game that is in the horror category, it will automatically show up right here on the website. So um, whenever you play something that is, uh, you know, in the horror category, as mentioned, it will show up here. You don't need to do anything else. Just put in the right game in your category, right? And it will show up here. Hey, hey, hey. Great that you're all, all joining Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Thanks, Mod Monkey. Okay, here are the games. What you see there is, of course, like the um, heart rate that has been measured. It's actually like the average heart rate, which is a great indicator for how scary a game is, right? So if you have a game that has an average heart rate, um, like above 100, it's probably very scary compared to a game that is around 70, right? So it can, could be pretty lame then. And uh, so you, you see basically the latest horror games here. Um, also like the number of heartbeats that we already measured. You will also see a little bit of, you know, like what, what the game is actually about. 
a short yeah, like overview of this. When you click on the game, and again, excuse the hiccup on the side, it's on, only on my laptop, of course. Uh, you, you can also see the streamers and top streamers that have been playing this game. <laughs> you know this guy, you, you've, you probably have seen him around. If, we, if we're lucky, then Asher has also joined the stream. <laughs> um, what happens there, I'm going to come back to this a little bit later. Uh, you can also see some recommendations about games that are, you know, comparable in the area of, you know, like, scariness. And um, so you can pick maybe some nice game for your next stream that you haven't been aware of, right? For example, I never heard of Rojo. I don't know this game. Never heard of this. Um, and it's for, for me, it's really nice. I've seen many games that I've never seen before and never heard of before. And I think that's actually what this should be about a little bit, right? So new games, new communities that you can find. Uh, what you see here is the Now Live tab. Um, I think, unfortunately, just a few minutes ago, no one was live who was streaming a horror game. So you will only find um, streamers that are currently playing a horror game right now, right? So if there's no one showing up, then there's probably no one streaming a horror game right now, okay? Uh, so if you want to be there, then you basically just have to use Hybrid during your stream. Uh, you play a horror game and you will be there on this list. Um, by the way, just uh, as I mentioned it before, if you have any questions, then uh, you can just, you know, add exclamation mark, ask and uh, add your question. So we all have it sorted at the end of the stream where we do a little bit of, you know, Q&A afterwards. So no one's stream right now. Here you'll find leaderboard. This is basically um, all of the people that have been playing horror games in the past who have been testing um, are already here. You basically have like the highest heart rate and it then goes down a little bit. So the scaredy cats are the ones who have a really high heart rate, the highest heart rate during the games and the fearless warriors are the ones with the lowest heart rate when they were playing, um, when they were playing a game. Uh, you can then, you know, if, we, if you click on them, you will come right to their um, Twitch, um, you know, check out their community. Um, if you, you know, think that they could be a great match, uh, you can also search for streamers. Uh, if you have someone on your mind where you wanted to know, like, what's their average heart rate when they're playing horror games? And also add like some suggestions that you would like to add um, for the site some feedback we're always looking for a feedback uh what we're also adding is game reviews because <laughs> we want to do a little bit more of you know like do a little bit of reviews for horror games we already did like one for the mortuary system which is a really cool game it's very scary actually <laughs> and uh, we want to add like at least one review per week if you're interested in adding a written game review or a video game review to this then just let us know, send us a message, add it on Discord. We're super happy to feature anyone who wants to, you know, put their own review and content uh, on the site. So we're happy to add all of this here. Um, of course, then, how to join. You know how to join. You need to use Hybrid, um, play horror game, and then you automatically end up on Fright Rate. But there's one more thing. <laughs> Highlights. So what we've been working really hard in the past few weeks is um, basically a highlight function. So when you're... I need to pause this, I think. And it works a lot better on your computer, I promise. <laughs> it's my old Kröte that really don't want to <laughs> work right now. It's basically... A function that we added here it's automatic highlighting from your last stream so if you're using hybrid if you're playing a horror game on your stream and then if you have basically if we detect a highlight then we will automatically cut it 
and add it here on the side and you can, you know, review it, you can look for it, you can use it for your own social media, just, you know, right click on it, save the video, um, edit it, do whatever you want with it. Um, you can add some likes here, you can find out more about what game it was, it was Outlast here, the streamer, you can go right to their Twitch account and what you see here is basically the, like the moment, the trigger moment. Uh, for you know for the heart rate where we thought and basically the emotional moment that happened that you know basically triggered the highlight so it was 101 the pulse was 101 um, where this highlight was triggered and here it is so ariana can basically take this um, and share it on their social media uh, these highlights will be there on the site um, we will also do, uh, let's, let's, I think we will do at least in the community, some kind of, you know, featuring of this. You don't have to clip them all by yourself because there are so many moments where you just miss out on adding this. Um, and there's also, it's not only based on the heart rate, there's some, some more, um, things where we actually go into some research, like, like really scientific research and partnering with the university. Um, which is really cool. It's about, you know, researching for, uh, you know, games and, uh, and heart rate and all the effects in between, uh, which is really super interesting. It's University of Munich. And uh, I'm, I'm super hyped for this. I love this so much. Like so, some of the highlights that I basically have not seen any highlight yet or where I didn't think like, oh, this is not cool. So I still... This thing is, um, especially the highlight thing, it's still an in beta thing. So we're happy. Um, we actually are looking for some feedback from your side. What's good? What's not? What, um, what are you basically missing? Is there any feature that you would like to see there? Um, and yeah, basically how it's working for you. Um, and we're building a little bit up from there, right? So let's wrap this up. We have... Basically, we have at the um, here you see like games, new games that are and top games, new entries basically of games that you streamed as streamers in your uh, streams. <laughs> this is basically all the other games that you streamed with hype rate in the horror category right here. They will end up right here automatically, right? Um, new entries, most scary, less scary. And like some hot picks where you think like these are especially great games. New entries are always the latest games that have been added. You don't need to do anything but just stream stream a game that is basically a horror game and it will end up here. Um, just like you, if you're streaming a horror game right now, then you would be here on the Now Live tab. Um, unfortunately, I don't think anyone is streaming. Just a few minutes ago, no one was streaming. Uh, there's no one here. Um, you will also be added to the leaderboard if you're streaming a horror game and using hybrid, hybrid um, during your stream. You can search for streamers. You can add, you know, you can you can go to their Twitch accounts, join their community, uh, check them out, find out what was you know happening there. Um, one thing that I forgot, um, also at the at the game tabs, you can also see then highlights. For the games, especially if you want to look a little bit more, you know, find out more about the games. Um, game reviews, if you want to add some content here, if you want to write a game review, if you want to, you know, do a video game review, let us know. We're so happy to feature you there. And highlights, which is the hottest, latest feature what we've been working so hard in the past few weeks. The whole team, <laughs> basically everyone. of moments that happened during your streams when you were playing a horror game where we thought okay this is a really great moment something happened there you i don't know you had some kind of emotion and your heart rate match where we think oh this must be a highlight this something happened those will automatically end up here all you have to do is use hybrid and stream a horror game and these are the updates <laughs> <laughs> so we will uh, I see some questions happened uh, in the meantime I saw some some things in the meantime so let's I'll keep this up for, for a moment and check what you all were writing there 
Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, latest 15, right, right. Okay. Okay, so, so cool. Yeah, I love this. What's up in hot tub? <laughs> What's up in the hot tub? <laughs> so I could open, should I, should I open the Discord? <laughs> I could add the guys right here in the Q&A. Let's see, I could add them here. We could, we should test this. Can someone say hi? They don't want to say hi, right? <laughs> or maybe I just dropped out of the Discord. This could also be. Hey. Oh, they're all muted. Ah, okay. It worked. It worked. All right. 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 There's also one, one of the features that was also uh, like new was that you can basically hear your own heartbeat sound. Right. So it's, you know, when you um, pass a certain threshold, you can put it like when it passed a certain threshold, like 100, then, you know, it adds there for like 15 seconds or something, whatever you add there. And then it goes like, ding, ding, ding. like here you are on own heartbeat. It's like another, another great way of highlighting that something special is happening. Um, all right. So let's, I'll check if there were any other questions that I didn't see. So. Will there be a dashboard or a similar that links our heart rate to the VOD so we can go back and see what caused our heart rate to spike, for example? Um, I mean, so far we we have we are considering many things to add. Um, a dashboard could be could be an idea. Um, I mean, right now we're um, focusing on on the highlight function. For the moment, but we're we're happy to take any of the ideas and and see what we can we can make of this. Especially with the, I I understand that if you have like a dashboard and you see like okay so there was a there was a spike in the heart rate uh, so what actually happened there? It could be super interesting, right? I'll put past two hundred ppm article. <laughs> it should be something like this. Look, call the emergency. Like I, I maybe I'm, I'm passing out. <laughs> something like this. Okay, is there any future plans to give developers direct access to the heart rate without going through the widget? To build a small page from, you know, from that I can make alerts for her sound. You can, um, I mean, you can, like without passing through the widget, you basically just uh, ask for the API access. You can do this on our Discord and we can discuss whatever you want to do with this um, and see what's possible, right? Um, you, if, you're, if you're not already on the Discord, let's see, I should have Discord here. It up and then just yes there we go <laughs> just join our discord um as for the um api access uh, and we can we can make this possible so you get access it's like guys do you have any questions maybe to the team maybe to yannick <laughs> to, to no glorious yes yes he wants to take all your questions all of them at once. No, nope, I <laughs> yes. don't want to. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> so what I um, what what I'm looking forward to is actually that I want to um, uh, like from my perspective, I want to do a little bit more of um, horror game stuff, um, especially on our channel. Um, I want to play more horror games, especially since I really don't like horror games. <laughs> I want to do this a little bit more. And I want to feature some of you creators. Um, when there's more news coming on this um, during the next few weeks. So if any of you want to, you know, maybe join for, for, for you know, for a stream, uh, for a co-stream or anything, just, you know, let me know. Let, let us know on the Discord. Uh, so I'm always happy to, to have you guys there. It's merch, exactly. What we're doing, we're working on something on merch. Because I need to have a I need to have a t-shirt. I need to have a hoodie for this. <laughs> Maybe a version that will work with Tyson. Ah, yeah, Tyson is always a uh, Tyson is always a thing, right? Um, so about Tyson, I um, can't speak for for all of the developers and what's currently um, you know on the on the map that is possible and that is focused right now. Um, but I will. I will we will, we will, I will get back to the team actually and ask what, what's going to happen with Tyson because from, it's always about like how many people are asking for for something and how much focus you want to put in this since it's a community project basically. 
Um, and uh, I, will, I, will, I will ask back and see what's what's happening there. I have a crazy idea that I wish I could implement using hybrid. What's really doing? Spinning while streaming, like a fitness and horror. Yes, yes. Send us a message. Doing some spinning. Like, wasn't there a guy who was basically doing uh, sports while streaming and playing at the same time? That was also something. I also love when, when people are doing like sports streams. It's always interesting, but spinning, I, I really, I, I really want to know your idea. Could be really interesting. So what else, what else, what else? Maybe I missed on something. <laughs> I <laughs> got one idea. information. What the clips think? are rotating in around uh, four weeks. Like every four weeks, you are getting uh, new clips with the uh, hot uh, or with the with the most likes on the highlights page. Ah. And um, we we are actually working on some more additions, actually related to the research we we have been working on. Um, we we plan to because you will see now in the in the in the highlights that you see that the cutting um, is not always right on point, right? So we are actually working on the tool that does this fully automatic to make the cut exactly when the cut needs to happen to to help you just have the right feature. And the only thing you have to do is just share it. And and then that's the deal. And we are also working on um, some other cool features that uh, will extend not, all, not only in the horror genre, but also go beyond that. So you have to stay tuned for that as well. And um, in the next weeks, um, there will become some cool new features and we will keep you guys updated for that. Yes, of course. So this is like, um, so the, I mean, the, the, the horror thing is a, the horror thing. I think the horror genre is like the perfect, the perfect way of, you know, looking into how highlights are actually happening. I also love that there's actually like some, some research um, in this area that goes, you know, basically directly into, into gaming uh, and the heart rate and how it basically, you know, how it all comes together and how it's, you know, connected and everything. And there's like a scientific background um, to this. I, I love this part, actually. It's, it's really, really great. And about the other features, yeah, let's let's stay, let's stay tuned. Let's stay tuned for, for, for some more updates that are definitely coming for that. And also, like, if you have ideas, if you have, you know, feedback about things, just let us please know because we want to, you know, do more um of things that are good <laughs> right and remember it's all beta still it's all some beta features here we're trying out new stuff and rely basically on your feedback and what you need to do what you need to what you want to see here i mean is one of, what was that one of my fitness it's, it was riding a fitness bike while playing fortnite what <laughs> i can't even ride a fitness bike and do like I would not be able to play Fortnite. Not that I could play Hearthstone, maybe. I love to do social media while doing uh, like sitting on a cardio bike. That's actually great, but it's not. It's not basically stuff for streaming. <laughs> not very interesting watching me doing social social media. <laughs> Did anyone mention the web page? Oh, now I don't know what you mean. What do you mean? Oh, right, it's right. <laughs> It's frightrate.com. So you all know Hybrate. This is frightrate.com. See, check this out. Frightrate.com. You will, you will be on this. Yeah, right here. Just wanted to post it. It's just super important. <laughs> I'm curious how, how many of you will, you know, start start looking for your highlights. How many highlights of you will end up here? I'm really curious. I can't can't wait to see more highlights. <laughs> Great. Yeah, I, I already got one feature request. Really? You should um yeah, look up your highlights by your own ID. Because currently we are only um selecting the latest 15 from mm. uh each table, like the 15 highlights with the most likes and 15 highlights with the most recent uh, create date, and it's not possible to search by your own ID. 
like that you actually can see your highlights to your own channel and not filtering it out from or hoping that it's in the list of the 15 highlights. Hmm. Yeah, so if you go to the home button and click on the gamer there, right? Or if you just click on the leaderboard and you just select the gamer, you can click on your on your profile and you will see the highlights you created. Um, and there's there's one thing. So what we did is we actually built a model in the backend um, that does the highlight detection. So the more data we gather from you, um, the better the models will be. And we, we built not one specific model that is generalizing of all the data, but we try to fit it to your personal playing style. So um, don't be scared if at the beginning the highlights are not like perfect or the thing you'd expect them to be is they will get better over time. Um, so the more you play, um, the better the highlights will be. So yeah, that's actually the beauty of it. That's just, yes. that's, I love this. So I, I'm the only one who didn't understand the ID stuff. Oh, also one important thing, one imp really important thing, because there will be an update to the hybrid uh, uh, app, of course, right? Which is currently still in beta you of course will need to um like it's really important that you then if you want to add if you want to end basically here if you want to partake in this you need to log in via twitch right um if you skip it then we can basically you know identify and come back basically identify and put you here on the side uh, we basically can't match this really well. Um, so if you log in then via Twitch, then it's then it works. It's a new feature. The update is available at this moment. Yes. So update is coming. And it's um, yeah, features at Twitch login where you log in with Twitch and then you're here and we can, you know, put everything in the back. Just like a strong relationship, it gets better. Yes. That's actually true. That's really true. <laughs> Woody knows. <laughs> so our, all of our heart rates have been going down. We, we, we're just we're just below one hundred. Yeah, it's with the new update. It was actually super important. I forgot it, and I forgot it. So new update on the hybrid app with the Twitch login. Ideally, don't skip it. Otherwise, we cannot you know match you with this. You can log in later too. But you need to log in with Twitch then to be, you know, to 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 use it with Fright Rate, uh, stream horror games, use hybrid, and then you will be here featured on the side in the leaderboards. Highlights will be created from your um, from your streams. Uh, you can use them. Just go like right click, save the video, right. So here it's in it's, it's in Deutsch here. It's in German here. Video speichern unter, or you know, save video as, and then you you have the video for yourself. And then you can also look for I think usernames, and um, I think even games, but there's more coming to this. Yeah, but only the latest fifteen. Only, only the fifteen. All right, all right. So, guys, do you have any more questions? Any more questions? Our ideas, our feedback. Because otherwise, we would then send everyone to bed because they've been working <laughs> all night long. <laughs> and then they need to sleep. Um, guys, it was really great. I'm so happy that I was able to show you our new features and what we did here for you, especially for the horror game community. Um, I can't wait to see more games on the side. I'm especially looking for some, some you know, games that no one knows if there's anything and to see more people on the leaderboard, more highlights, more game reviews. If you want to, you know, join this, um, if you want to do a game review, if you love writing and want to do some stuff, let us know. I'm super happy to to work with you and get you on a website. And um, yeah, also the no life button. Uh, I love to do this thing and check out some of you while you stream. Lady Bush, thank you. Brody Bro. <laughs> Guys, thanks all so much. Get us some feedback on the Discord or wherever you like. 
and I it's better this God, I think. <laughs> and yeah, let's talk soon. Stay out. You should uh, was it write like someone. good night, good fright? What? You should rate someone. We should we should rate someone. Uh yes. Yeah, but let's see who's, who's online. You got someone. Someone yeah, who's but using high she's rate. Be taking a break. At least for one minute or so. What is she doing on hybrid? But she's not and doing she has... game. I sent you a Discord uh, message. Okay. Let us see. Da, da, da. You said, oh, wait, there. Uh huh. I didn't know her yet. So let's do this. I hope she. And hopefully, she comes back in a few seconds. I need to type it. It doesn't copy. D -E yeah. oh. How many times can I misspell a name? D many times. T. Yeah, like oh, countless, countless times. <laughs> okay, so. This channel. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's work. My overlay doesn't work properly, so if you can do something, then uh, ah, okay, now nah, it's working. Okay, right, guys. I'm so happy that you liked the new update. Um, we will, of course, like announce it on all the channels that we have. So we, of course, we would love if you share any of this. <laughs> We would love to get to, uh, you know, more people to know what we're doing and um, actually to broaden our community. I would also love if you find some new people, um, you know, from Fright Rate and get to know our community better. Like maybe you do some, um, you know, co-streaming. Maybe you find some new people where you can, you know, add your add to your community. We would love this. Then don't forget to get us some uh, feedback on our Discord channel. We need your feedback. And we hope you have a wonderful, yeah, start to the week. Talk to you soon, guys. Yeah, what was it? Good night, good fright. <laughs> Talk to you soon, guys. See you soon.